hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a brand new video. I have a Primark haul today, but there's loads of amazing kind of gift ideas from their gifting section this year within this video. So if you're yet to check out Primark gifting for Christmas gift ideas, highly recommend you do. I think this year is by far the best they've ever done. Also kind of standing up because I have a couple of clothing items to share with you. They also have some amazing party wear that I've been keeping my eyes peeled for. So who knows, maybe I need to go back and do some kind of haul including some of their party wear, maybe for New Year's ideas, New Year's Eve outfit ideas. Anyway, I'm gonna jump into this because I have two huge bags full of things to share with you. I feel like I might as well jump into two items that I've already included within my other gift guides this year because I don't wanna duplicate content too much. I'm just gonna quickly show you these and then move on from them. So they have this gifting set for coffee lovers, which I think is great. Tom's already claimed this for his own. He said, yes, please, I'll have that. It's basically just a little filter coffee set, which I think is great. They have these hot water bottle gift sets. They have a few different designs. I particularly loved this white waffle set. So you get the headband, the eye mask, and then the actual hot water bottle itself. Very sort of minimal, white company style, looks expensive. But it's from Primark, so it's a bargain. I've taken the price off these, which is annoying, but if you've seen my other gift guides, I talk about the price of them too in that. Anyway, moving on to the other items now, which I'm yet to share. So this is interesting. This is £10, and it is a jewellery advent calendar. So this is how it comes. So you can actually see all the pieces that are included. They had a silver and a gold set. You actually take off this plastic cover and put this cover on the front so it acts as the advent calendar with all the doors and everything but this to me looked very Jo Malone I know their advent calendars which are so expensive um look very similar to this sort of townhouse style black and white with a bit of gold very minimal and some of the pieces that are included in this are lovely oh I love this they had some well in fact they had loads of pet gifting as well so I bought this at five pounds called my best friend treat baking kit which in itself for five pounds to get the baking kit is amazing but also the fact that it comes with a little bone shaped cookie cutter which you can obviously keep and reuse for homemade treats is really good i picked that one up for a little barney boo and then similarly but for the humans we have a little sugar cookie baking cone these ones are only three pounds and again they come with the cookie cutter this one is um obviously gingerbread shaped i also thought this would make a great stocking filler it is from the homeware section which the primark in manchester which is the one i went to the city center the homeware is amazing i'm always rave about it but it really really is so they have this sleep oil uh, which is £2.50 and you can pop these in essential oil burners like one that I've got um, back here somewhere. You could maybe go with this as a gift set and if you maybe bought a aromatic diffuser as well. So I've also got these from the home fragrance section at £2. It is a tube of the Relax Scented Reed diff not Reed Diffusers incense but it's just something about primark calls that gets so excited for i think because i get so many bargains i'm just like oh i can't wait to share them all with you okay so this one was only two pounds this next one for the tea lover peppermint and fennel tea they did have different flavors available but i thought this one would be a good all-rounder two pounds good little stocking filler i'm going to pop these in tom's niece's stockings um or sacks prezzies that we bought for them this year and they're from dairy milk they had loads of gifting from dairy milk within primark they had the toblerone as well they had the personalized station so you can personalize your toblerone or your dairy milk these are just two of the gift sets that they had kind of diy section of a little christmas tree and a christmas cabin which i think both are adorable they were originally priced at seven pounds they've marked them up as four i think they've changed all the prices on their dairy milk gifting because it was very expensive seven pounds essentially for a little bit of dairy milk chocolate which i think is quite a lot so yeah the fact that they've repriced them to four pounds i think was a good move on their part i don't know whether they were priced wrong initially or what because it seemed a lot some of the prices that they had for some of the things was definitely too much i got this one for myself because i always think they're handy to have uh whether or not you cast them as a stocking filler i don't know they're only 80p and they're a pack of replacement diffuser sticks so for someone who always tends to have re-diffusers in and around the house 
These are really good for just switching out or replacing any kind of old diffuser sticks that have been there for a couple of weeks. If to refresh them, it does actually make a big difference. They have black ones as well. I have purchased this year from Etsy. It still hasn't arrived yet, so I'm hoping it will do soon, but some green ribbon, some like dark green velvet ribbon. However, in the meantime, I spotted that Primark do uh, three meter rolls for a pound, which I think is even cheaper than what I paid for for Etsy, the Etsy one. So I'm a little bit gutted about that, but the other one's on route, so I didn't want to buy too many. I think this will work really well on brown craft paper. So that's the thing we're going for, mostly brown craft paper with a little bit of green in there too. This set at seven pounds, again for the coffee lover, I thought looked really nice, so I would have picked it up to include it within this gift guide video. So it includes nine different flavors. We've got French vanilla, hazelnut, Irish cream, salted caramel, latte, gingerbread, pumpkin spice, always a fave, peppermint and butter toffee, which I thought sounded lovely. They had some amazing stationery as well. So I picked up these for the kind of person who likes a bit of mindfulness, a bit of meditation, a bit of manifestation, why not? These journals are so gorgeous. At only three pound, well this one's three pound, this one's only two pound fifty. This mindfulness one, which is just mindfulness journal, loads of different kind of trackers, habit trackers, exercise, how you're feeling, moods. And then this sleep journal is really interesting. It basically allows you to log your sleep. And especially if you are the sort of person that maybe struggles to sleep, has a bit of insomnia, it allows you to kind of log if you'd maybe had a drink or caffeine, what time you finished caffeine, is to kind of track your sleep pattern to try and figure out what works best for you. I always think it'd be fun to maybe include your dream in there as well. I think dreams are the most interesting thing ever. I dream, I'm gonna say most nights, I will wake up and remember a dream. Tom never dreams. He just doesn't remember them. Maybe one a year he might say, oh, I had a dream last night. And I'm like, oh, tell me, tell me, because you never have dreams. Are you a dreamer or are you a sleep solid, never dream kind of person? This is to add to my little ceramic house collection that I've got going on. This one's only £2.50, so I feel like the Primark ones are really affordable. Another foodie, yummy gifting item from Bailey's, it was £6. And within here you get obviously a nice generously sized mug from Bailey's in this gorgeous cream and black. And then it comes with a mix of red velvet mug cake. So you actually bake the mug, bake the cake in the mug. Then I also saw this mug cake. This one was a bit cheaper because it's not branded with sort of Bailey's or anything like that. It's just a cute little gingerbread mug. I say little, it's actually quite a big mug. At five pounds, you get a little gingerbread spoon which kind of hooks and sits on your on the side of your mug and obviously you can use it to eat your mug cake because this is yet again another mug cake kit. This one is chocolate flavoured and yes that one is for myself, from me to me this year. Then I saw this Himalayan salt gift set at £6. It comes with a cream and gold rimmed little dish with a little gold grater as well and then a little linen bag with a block of Himalayan salt in so you can actually grate it yourself whether you use it as bath salts whether you use it in the bathroom or whether you use it in cooking so six pounds that one was oh i just picked these ones up for myself um at one pound i needed some gloves they do these finger what they called like tablet screen touching ones so you don't have to take your gloves off. And then I also picked up these £3.50, a pack of two pairs of performance socks. These are just a really good uh, pair of socks for walking in, so you get black and grey in there. For gifting though, they do have some gorgeous kind of gift set for cosy socks and just a bit nicer than just performance socks for gifting. So I decided to pick up this one. It's a two pack of chenille cosy socks, £2.50. Some of their cozy socks now I've noticed shed. So I feel like if you just kind of do this to them when you're buying them, just to check that they don't shed loads of fluff. These ones don't seem to be doing that. So that's why I picked up these two. Nice and wearable colors, £2.50 they are. Then the last thing within this bag, a gorgeous scarf. Now I loved this because of the thick 
bits at the bottom, the thick tassels, and obviously the colour as well. They did have another colour in this. This one was only £6. This is the Ecru colour. It's also from the Primark Cares range, made using recycled plastic. And I love this. It's so soft. I'm going to the Christmas market soon with some friends, and I just wanted to be nice and cosy, so I decided to pick this up as an extra layer if it does get chilly out there. It's just honestly like a blanket around my neck. So cozy, love the color. Probably gonna get makeup over it straight away. Next and final bag. Let me go get it. Ugh. It's a big one. So let's whiz through these. Yet again, another item from the pet section at five pounds. They had these Disney dog treats. I tell a lie, it wasn't from the pet section. It was actually from the Disney pet section. So Disney in itself has loads of gifting. They also had the pet section within the Disney gifting. So this is a little cracker with dog treats, bone shaped in the cracker. Loved the wrapping, honestly. That's what sold me. Next up, I got a reed diffuser, which I thought would make a lovely festive gift. Look how gorgeous that packaging is. It's definitely a dupe for rituals packaging, but I love it. So I'm not gonna complain, because it's a fraction of the price. This is in the scent cinnamon and clove. Their, their reed diffusers last up to eight weeks. The actual bottle is like a dark burgundy red as well. I saw someone else talk about this in a Primark haul and I thought we'd make a lovely gift alongside a bottle of wine if you actually want to get them a gift as well, especially if they're a wine lover. You can get their favorite bottle of wine in a bottle bag and then also pop this with it as well, which is a wine cooler. Maybe not if they're a red drinker. If they're a white or rosé drinker, you just simply have the stopper and the actual thing that goes within the bottle of wine and just keeps it cool, so it's steel. So I don't think you even need to chill it. Um, but yeah, eight pounds this one was. These smell so good. Scented sachet things that you can pop in gym bags or hang up in wardrobes or in smaller rooms. And they've got three new scents for Christmas. This Christmas Eve one, then cinnamon and clove, which matches the reed diffuser that I've just shown you. And then winter spice as well with a gorgeous little Christmassy tartan print on. These are two pounds each. This is something that I've seen people going mad over on Instagram. I'm trying to find these in Primark home stores. And at six pounds, they are these glass candlestick holders. You can pop a pillar candle in there. They're a white company dupe, let's face it. The white company ones are gorgeous, great for tablescape designs. It just looks beautiful. You can add some really nice scented tea lights in there or pillar candles. And these ones are six pound. They do feel quite cheap, but they, well like not cheap, but really lightweight and almost a bit flimsy. Like you could easily break it, but they are still glass. Last year I got from Zara Home a Christmas tree plate, very similar to this. I'm gonna say it. I think I prefer the Primark one. So I do love my Zara home one, obviously. I had a cheese board the other day and I used all the kind of star bowls and tree bowls that I've got. So I added this tree plate to my collection. They had a smaller one. This is the bigger one at eight pounds. I picked up these from the wellness section, just for our bathrooms. At two pounds, a two pack of bamboo body puffs that you get. And they just look nice. They're obviously just a body puff that helps your soap get all me. I mean, you know what one of these are. And then I also picked up these candlesticks. Oh, they're upside. Oh my God. I've just chipped one. Oh, damn it. You see the little chip there? Oh no. Oh no. Looks like that ticked off. Oh no. The small one is £3.50. The larger one is only £4. So I thought it'd be nice to get the two to stack side by side and you can pop a larger pillar candle on, but it's also got the hole in there should you wish to just put one of the uh, sort of church candles in. They do them in black as well. I'd love to say I bought this as a gift for someone, but I've definitely just bought it for myself. It's another one of these blanket hoodies. Snood, snoodies, what are they called? These call them, Primark call them the snoody. In a medium to large, 18 pounds I got. They didn't have, they had extra small to small or medium to large. So it's the sort of item that you wear as more of a blanket. So they're designed to be huge anyway. So I picked up this gorgeous baby pink one. I love the color of this. Even though I'm not a typical pink wearer, I just think it's lovely. So I do already have from a previous year, a dark charcoal gray one, which let's face it, Tom can definitely borrow and share with me because they are huge. But now I can wear my pink one when he wants to wear the gray one. Oh my God, look at it. I mean, fashionista. 
They've got like a pocket for all your snacks as well. It's so cozy, the hood is massive. This is the sort of thing that I used to do with my grey one. I first got it when we got Barney as a puppy. So all them outdoor toilet trips in January when it was freezing, this was straight on and it's honestly so cozy. They've got like a Disney edition one as well, but I just loved the colour of this one. What's this? Oh yeah, I forgot I got this. I love it. Love it. I'm just, I thought it was a blanket or something for some reason then. I got this coat. It's amazing. It's the softest thing I own. It's in a cream. I've got it in a large, which is 14 to 16. It's 40 pounds, which for Primark is a little more premium. But I got one of their coats in my last Primark haul, you might remember from the edit range. You know that new kind of luxe label that they've got. But this is gorgeous. This isn't from the Primark edit. It's literally just the normal Primark range. So 40 pounds is premium, I suppose, for Primark but it is so cozy, it's so soft. I wanted to size up to a large just because I know that this is gonna be a proper winter coat when it's freezing outside. I'm layering up with hoodies and sweatshirts underneath to keep really cozy and warm. This is potentially gonna be a Christmas markets outfit next week. Oh my goodness, oh, I'm gonna be so cozy. Really good length as well, it's gonna keep me nice and toasty. Honestly, I love winter. I've of course got some PJs to include within my Primark gifting. And also, of course, I bought them for myself. I've got two sets. So firstly, this, which is definitely a Christmas set of PJs. The medium, which is 12 to 14. I always tend to size up in my PJs. And this is the top. It's kind of got like a fair isle print in a dusky rose beige kind of colour. So that's what the top looks like. And then in the same pattern print super soft fabric as well are uh, the bottoms look how gorgeous that print is i love a fair old print so 13 pounds for the set i think is a pretty good price then the other set of pajamas that i got are a bit more luxe these are a satiny luxury kind of finished pajama these are beautiful so in a medium to large the top is 12 pounds so like i said far more premium because the other set is only 13, whereas this is 12 just for the top. But it's like a satiny shirt, college shirt with a big dramatic turn up on the sleeve, which kind of adds to that opulence. You know, it's in a champagne gold, very luxury. This is a Christmas Eve pajama, I feel. Wake up on Christmas morning and wear these pajamas. That's what I'm gonna do this year. So the bottoms I got in a medium to large as well at 12 pounds. Now these ones do actually have a cinch in waist though. So I feel like you can get away with sizing up with these pajamas. Cause you know that you can wear them nice and loose and comfortable, oh my God, they're huge. Like as in wide leg, I just love them. They've got a piping down the front. Honestly, the detail on these pajamas are incredible. They've got piping, detail all the way down the front with the really dramatic turn up on the bottom as well. Top at 12, bottoms at 12, 22, 24, quick maths, 24 pounds for a set of kind of luxury PJs. You can't go wrong with. The last thing I wanted to share with you is a bit of a, I'm not say a dupe because it's just a satin shirt, but I was gonna say a dupe for my Zara one that I've literally just featured in a Zara haul. It's a satin, a black satin shirt it doesn't really feel much different, and it's a fraction of the price. But I can't send the Zara one back now. This one's only 13 pounds, um, and it's nice and long. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't know why I've duplicated on another one, probably more so than anything, because I wanted to share it with you guys. Uh, but it will come in handy. I, I feel like I already know I'm gonna wear this shirt loads over the festive period. Black satin is just that added, touch of luxury. I might even wear it on Christmas day. Satin shirt with just comfy leggings, my Lululemon leggings. A satin shirt for a little bit of a dressier feel, but still oversized, comfy, relaxed. A bargain at that too. So that is everything that I picked up from Primark. I hope you guys have taken some inspiration on what is in some of their gifting. I kid you not, there's probably 10 times the amount of the gifting that I've shared with you in today's video. They have 
so much to choose from definitely by far the best year for gifting in my opinion and yeah well worth checking out that is everything that i've picked up recently from primark and let me know if you enjoyed this video by giving it a thumbs up subscribing for more let me know which are some of your favorite bits and i hope you have a lovely rest of your day and i hope to see you all very very soon in my next video bye guys